everybody, this is Marley and today I want to show you this mirror that I've made and um, I will putting a design paper in it soon because otherwise you will see me filming every time and you see lots of glint string but first um, I just wanted to make sure you can see it's actually a mirror you can see me with a scarf here <laughs> so um, let me first put a design paper in it but First, I want to show you this. Hold on, I will put a design paper on the mirror, and it was a really fun project to make. So, here we go. First, the swirl. Yes. So, here it is again. That's better. So, now you don't see me, but, um, well, you can see the mirror better now. And I've made this project for a Dutch uh, new company that's called Let's Get Busy. So the mirror was um, a wooden MDF um, plate and the mirror comes with it. But you have to decorate it um, all by yourself. So I've used the beautiful design papers from Pion Design. I love the vintage look of it. And I have um, went with some brown orange tones because this one is uh, going in the bathroom. So I had to match the colors. Well, let's get started. Let's go to the first um, corner. Oh, sorry, my camera. You can see I've torn off the design papers, curled them and um, put some lace behind it. And a rose. And uh, here are some leaves and a Tim Holtz swirl. And also some swirls from Ziva. Of course, on my blog you can find more um, photos and uh, the product names. So let me zoom in more. Um, as you can see, I've used a stone. It's called a bag of stones. And this one says trust. I've put a lot of stones on this mirror because I just wanted... Uh, to focus on the words so this one says love and there's a wooden button and some postage stamps and here you can see a little prima bird and I've used lots of materials that um, people use in um, well in other things than scrapbooking but I've used a lot of materials here you can see a feather some more flowers and there are some wooden uh, things like from trees and here is another uh, stone this one is called love and here you can see um, a prima bird and it's sitting on a key and there is a heart with a keyhole some crochet flowers more ziva swirls and here is a magnolia dragonfly and I've used the hinges from um, Tim Holtz and here you can see the beautiful lace. Oh, I'm sorry, this one is not right. Here I've used the zipper from Prima Marketing and it says create. I don't, yes, you can see it, it's zooming in and I've curled up the design papers again. So, um, to the other corner, here I've used some pearls, another swirl from Tim Holtz and here is another um, stone with a crochet flower and this one says faith some more um, flowers from wild orchid crafts another crochet flower with a rose in the middle and some bling bling in the center this one was on a necklace and I've just cut it off and placed it in the center of my flower some more leaves and another postage stamp and here is another stone that says love and here you can see some more wooden embellishments and a Prima Marketing bird. Some more flowers. And this is the last stone that says Joy. So you have trust, love, fate, love and joy. I love those stones. Here I've used some texture from uh, the Crafters Workshop. Another Magnolia Dragonfly and the hinge from Tim Holtz. And that was pretty much this mirror. I really love decorated it and it was really a fun project and um, yeah it's just something different and I love using um, 
I love used to work with how do you call it different materials than uh, you normally use on scrapbook projects so this was a really fun challenge for me and well it's getting a nice place in the bathroom so um, yeah that was pretty much it I will be back soon with uh, some more projects so thank you for watching and I can't wait to hear what you think of it so please leave me a comment I really enjoy reading them thank you so much and till next time bye bye